Um, aside from riding my bike, uh, typically I'm either gaming, uh, I'm editing videos and content for Instagram. Um, I also have a small YouTube channel. Um, I have a girlfriend, I play bass, I have uh, a dog, I have some cats, I have some friends as well. So typically it's uh, biking, uh, that's my number one passion. Apart from that, it's typically just either music or hanging out with friends or my friends. to the new Um, there's no particular individual, I typically just uh, like specific 
aspects and specific situations that some people go through. Uh, I appreciate how they handle things. Um, I don't look for icons, and I don't want to be one either. Uh, I think we're all equal. Uh, we just have to kind of uh, work together and share our passions and be friends. In life, uh, I value uh, compassion, friendship, and loyalty most. Um, you'll meet a lot of people in your life that aren't worth your time. You'll meet a lot of people that will try to take advantage of you. It's up to you to be able to filter out uh, who is worth your time and effort. Um, everybody has good points. A lot of people have um, negative aspects that they're going to try to push on to make themselves feel better. Um, so in life, it's really important to just be open, honest, respectful to everybody. Uh, treat everybody like you want to be treated yourself. Ignore the people who are trying to talk you down. Um, pay respect to people who are appreciative of you. And uh, if you like something someone's doing, tell them. Uh, everybody likes a pat on the shoulder. Uh, Moncton. Uh, Hub City, the Tri-City, um, the heart of New Brunswick, how are you? Uh, it's a beautiful location. There's a lot to do. It's definitely a tourist trap. Uh, you'll want to come here, visit. You may end up wanting to stay. There's a lot of work. There's a lot of uh, immigrants. There's a lot of uh, bilingual people. It's a beautiful place to live. It's close to New Brunswick and PI. Um, it's uh, gorgeous during the summer, uh, although a little bit too warm in the last couple of years. Uh, winters are tough, but they're not as tough as up north. Um, if somebody were to be coming to the province for the first time, Moncton would definitely be a place to recommend. Uh, it's a short drive away from, uh, again, all the maritime provinces. Uh, beautiful location. Uh, it's great. There's so much good things to say about Moncton. Um, the message to everybody um, is to keep focus. It's very easy to get distracted uh, from your ultimate goal, whether it's to uh, find a, an extra career or, you know, uh, becoming uh, a married person with uh, kids uh, and, uh, and in the home, maybe travel the world, maybe write a book. Uh, it's important to keep focused because what I've noticed myself being 31 now is that between 20 and 30 I was drifting. Uh, that's 10 years of my life lost, and if I was planning on retiring at like 55 or 60, well, that's out the window now. I'm going to be working until I'm 65, 70, 75. I may never stop working. Um, I don't feel bad about my life choices, but I realize that if, if I could have talked to my future self, I would have given myself the advice to keep focus. Uh, I would definitely have a different career path by now. Um, I originally wanted to go firefighter, I uh, became a uh, call center agent, uh, I, went for, um, uh, I went for a paramedic course, uh, I wasn't really anything I was interested in. Uh, if I had kept focus, um, I'd be in a different spot, whether that be good or bad, uh, it's always important to keep focus. Um, to this day, um, now that I'm 31, uh, I have new goals, uh, I have new challenges, but I still have the focus now that I had a few years ago when I realized that I was uh, losing my time. Uh, and if there's any piece of advice I can give to anybody, chase your dreams. As long as they're not absolutely unrealistic, you can probably achieve them. You know your own strengths and weaknesses better than anybody else. So shoot for what you know you can want, what you know you can get, what you know you can eventually achieve. To the new age, welcome to the new age. So if you guys are interested in seeing uh, more of this beautiful machine here, uh, I have an Instagram. It's Grand Obzin, so Grand O-B-Z-E-N. Uh, I also have a YouTube by the same channel. Uh, I post infrequently, but I do post sometimes on there. Uh, give me a follow.